everybody. Um, it is Saturday, March 20th, and there's a 24 and 48 readathon going on this weekend. And so I thought I would try to make a little vlog. It's, <laughs> I don't feel like it's going to be very interesting considering I'm only going to be in my house and maybe taking a walk outside, but I just wanted to tell you what I'm going to be reading. I'm going to be finishing my last book for the Book 2 Prize, Five Days Gone by Laura Cummings. I'm going to be reading Jane Eyre on my iPad, and I'm going to be listening to The Lacuna by Barbara Kingsolver on audio. And so those are my three books, and hopefully um, I will get one of them done at least this weekend. I would really like to do that, but I'm also attending a virtual conference today, and uh, you know, trying to get a bit of regular work from home done, and then also some cleaning done, and there's just a lot of things going on. I would, I feel like I would be more organized being forced to stay in my house for such a long time, but um, I'm not that organized. I feel like the house is quite chaotic, actually, just because there's projects everywhere, and there's um, different stages of those projects and then there's dishes, but I don't really want to do the dishes and there's vacuuming, but I don't really want to do the vacuuming. So um, that's where I am right now. But here's my little vlog of this weekend. And I hope if you're um, reading this weekend and participating that uh, you are staying sane and um, being well. Okay, I'll check in later. Hi everyone. Today is Wednesday, the 25th of March, and um, I didn't really conclude the vlog from the weekend, so I thought I would just keep it going. It is such a weird time. Do I need to say that? No. Everybody knows that already. Uh, and I'm just trying to find some sort of a baseline right now like a baseline of um I don't know is normal possible I don't know if normal is possible but I'm trying to find a baseline with which to get through each day and um I'm still reading the same books oh sorry I did finish one I finished my last book for the book two prize um and so I submitted my votes for that, and that's really exciting. And I'm planning to, like, there's videos I want to film. There's, I, I, I've just created, uh, created a plan yesterday with my work for working from home. So that's created, and that's good. That's a grounding thing. So I know what days I'll be working, and I know what hours those will be, and I know that on those days I'm going to try to have a really good routine because 
it has been because my kids have been on spring break I haven't been wanting to instill a strict routine with them because I wanted them to have a chance to just be lazy and have fun and not not be strict with them but next week you know they would be going back to school and so we need something we need something regular and we need something that keeps this what's going on right now in perspective somehow so I'm still working on that that's not established at all but um I'm still reading Jane Eyre. I'm, I think I have about 200 pages left of Jane Eyre, maybe under 200 pages. So, um, and I'm still listening to The Lacuna. The Lacuna by Barbara Kingsolver is a very long audiobook. I'm getting near the end and um, it's wonderful. I really enjoy it. It's a great, great book. But whenever I'm listening to a long audiobook, I do start to get a bit of fatigue. Um, maybe that's just the case when you read a long book in general. So, um, yeah, I'm anxious to get it finished. And, um, so that's my reading. Art-wise, um, you can see this is up here. And it's ready for the next stage. And, um, I will get to it. I actually have to make some videos for my museum job. So that's going to be something I'm doing tomorrow because I have to get out pretty quick. And yeah, so that's just the update for where we are on Wednesday. And um, oh, I saw that Simon from Savage Reads is hosting a readathon read -thon this weekend. So the 28th and the 29th. Yeah. Um, so I think I might try to read along with that, even though I'm still reading the same books. I mean, there's nothing exciting. I might add a new one in, you know, <laughs> maybe a poetry collection, something um, manageable and attainable. Obviously, I can't go to the library. So I can download books from the library that are available and audiobooks. So I will be doing that when I can or when I need to, and I'm very anxious for the results for the ebook two prize to be released because um, I'm potentially going to have to be ordering all these books uh, or buying them all because I can't go get them at the library. So yeah, and I'm going to be doing fiction this round. So that's cool. And now I'm just kind of rambling. So that is my update for Wednesday. I'm going to keep the blog going because I don't have a ton of footage from last weekend. And so it'll just be, uh, it'll have some other stuff in there. And um, everybody's struggling, I think, uh, on BookTube. Um, and it, I just noticed that there was a lot in my feed and now today there's almost nothing. And I feel like um, that's indicative of kind of a fatigue of um, dealing with this situation, you know, and trying to, um, come to a normal and come to some sort of a rhythm, but it's really hard to create a rhythm when you're in this type of a, like, I, I think, I mean, obviously I've never been in this situation before, but I feel like it's hard to create a rhythm. So yeah, that's what's going on. So I will check in again at some point and I'm going to keep reading and you're going to keep reading and the world is going to keep moving no matter how this virus moves and, um
everyone. So we've made it to Friday, March 27th. And um, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Uh, this has certainly been a hodgepodge vlog <laughs> with very little cohesion. And um, I think that we're all just doing our best. And I think that you all will be okay with whatever this manifests into. Um, I think I'm going to start a new vlog for this weekend. So maybe the weekends will be my marker to start something new for the time being. And I think I'm going to do Simon of Savage Reads' High Bear Nation this weekend, along with um, getting into my studio because um, my husband's been using the studio as his office while he's working from home. And so he does a lot of meetings and he needs to be, have quiet. And um, so I'm going to uh, take the room over for the weekend and then he has it again uh, on the weekdays. So that's what's working here right now. <laughs> um, well, is it working? I don't know. We're just, this is what we're doing. Maybe that's a better way to put it. We're doing this. Whether or not it's working will be seen at a later date. So I hope you've had an okay week. I hope you're managing. I hope you're managing your anxiety. I hope you're managing your stress. I hope you're managing to find some joy and some little pockets of time where you can feel any sense of normal or any sense of calm possible. And I will check in again. Um, with another vlog later. So bye for now.